Yo, what's going on everybody? Lowe's here, coming back at you with another haul video. This is a cool one because it was a comic book store in Brooklyn, New York. So if you want to know what books I picked up, hop on that train, take a journey with me. So we're back, and as you can see from the video, it was a nice little spot. The owner was super cool, a guy named Gary. Um, and, um, you know, I went there, uh, you, you know, we, we came to New York um, this past weekend um, for a, you know, a birthday party. And we had some time, and I was able to find a comic book store that was close by to the hotel. And so I took the family. We all kind of went. It was basically a couple, you know, 15, 10 minute walk away. And um, it was pretty cool. Nice little spot. Um, had a, a lot of comics. Um, you know, almost everything was, was like five bucks or something like that. A couple of them were, you know, a little less. Um, and, um, you know, just a really cool guy. Um, you know, he had some toys and Pokemon cards and pops and all types of stuff in there. It was a little shop, but he had a lot of stuff packed in there. And, uh, you know, like I said, super friendly guy, you know, he was talking to the kids and stuff like that, talking to my wife and, um, you know, I, I had some time to do some digging. So, you know, wife kind of took a little walk, got the coffee, gave me a little time to do some digging. So these are the books that I picked up and, um, I believe all these books I got for about 30 bucks. So, um, first one up is Amazing Spider-Man 16.1. It's a nice little variant cover. Uh, next is... Uh, the Uncanny in Humans number zero, uh, another variant cover, but this was a cool like Howard the Duck. Um, just it, it gave me uh, kind of like this like psychedelic uh, kind of vibe to it, so I kind of dug it. Um, this was the Good Asian second print, number one second print. So I know this book got hot for a little bit, um, the first print anyway. Um, but I figured that you know what, second prints are kind of on the rise too. Uh, another book that I got was this one right here and that is uh, cataclysm the ultimate's last stand number three and i believe um this is like the first miles morales in the earth 616 or whatever some nonsense like that i know it's one of those uh like kind of storylines or whatever so you know whenever i see it i pick it up um this next one is x-men 53 and this is the first appearance of onslaught and i believe 54 is the first cover or something like that so um, but it was a nice little two-pack together, you know, again, for five bucks. Uh, this is another one that started to heat up a little bit, and this is Amazing Spider-Man number seven. Um, and I believe it has because of uh, this guy down here, you know, Spider-Britain or something like that. So, again, uh, with the Spider-Verse, um, Miles Morales Spider-Verse movie coming out, you know, all these Spider-Books are popping. Uh, another book that I got is this one right here, New Avengers number 40, the second print. And um, this is another uh, 
first appearance of somebody who's going to be in like Secret Invasion or something like that. So, um, you know, again, when you ever see second prints like that for these books that kind of, you know, on the rise, definitely scoop it up. And um, so I had my eye on another book, but I wasn't too sure about it. But when I went to go pay for everything, um, the guy was like, hey, you know what? Go pick out another book for free or whatever and stuff like that. So I already had my eye on one. So I was like, hey, you know what? It was right there. And that is uh, Punisher number. This is the miniseries, his first miniseries. So the five issue series. And this is number five right here. Um, decent copy, you know, maybe like one or two spine ticks, but um, maybe a little stack bend, but nothing that you can't press out. But, you know, for, for five bucks, I was like, yeah, or for free. So I was like, yeah, I'll take it. Um, I think with everything it ended up being like uh because of the free book and then the other book that had like a two pack i think it came out to like three dollars or something cents a book or something like that or four dollars a book so i'll take it um but like i said it was a nice little spot if you're ever in brooklyn it was in the sheep's head bay area so if you're ever in that area um and you're just around you want to look for some comics uh definitely go check out the stand um i'll leave the links below uh so at least you have the address and the name so if you want to go check it out um but like i said the owner was very cool very pleasantable um i don't even know if that's a word um but he was a very pleasant guy to talk to and um yeah had a great time and uh like i said picked up some good books so hope you guys enjoyed the books let me know what was your favorite and until next time talk to you guys later peace